deconstructed. And we'll put our fire pole back in as well, get rid of this crap. And that's the build done. And then the only thing we need to do now is, is decide whether I'm going to vacuum this out. Don't think I'm going to. Um, well, I could do. I do have a pump in here, but it'd take feckin' ages with one pump. And also where my feed's going to come from. So if this is my petroleum pipe, uh, what I can do... I don't really want to have a pipe sat in here just full of petroleum. I know it's not so much of a big deal when it's like 70 degree petroleum, but if it's 400 degrees or 300 degrees, it's going to be. <clears throat> I say mechanism is how they get long range space probes to work with heat from radioactive material. That's really cool, Newton. Mr. Life, can you please make some crystal shine bugs for the prisoners? They need a nightlight so they can read their books. They have lights in their bedrooms, hamster. Uh, what I did was I killed off all of our shine bugs. Um, and so, because I felt so terrible about that, I gave every room its own light. You see? I mean, they exercise in darkness, but their bedrooms are lit up. I can't do crystal shine bugs. We have no shine bugs left. They're all dead. I can't do it. I would if I could, but I can't. They're all dead, dead, dead. Dead, dead. Very dead. Uh, by the way, the whole time we've been playing tonight, I have had a big sweep command out around the base. So we will have been sweeping up some more goodies as well. A lot of this stuff doesn't have a home, so coal and stuff we can't actually sweep anywhere because we've got coal compactors stored up here that are full to the brim. Um, so we have been doing some other stuff as well. Which is why I've been doing everything priority nine. Because if they're not busy with what I'm doing, they'll be doing something else in the base. So I don't feel like we've uh, wasted too much time tonight. We've done quite a, lot of, quite a lot, really, in terms of getting this online. So let's... Yeah, I don't think I need anything else in here. We'll just seal this up. Um, and then what I'm probably going to do... What did I build these out of? Fucking gold. What I want to do, let's get a bit more thermium made. I don't think I'm going to make them out of thermium yet, but I'm going to see how this runs. And if it gets hot as balls, we might need some more thermium. Um, I've got a real problem with tungsten at the minute. And wolframite. I might have to do some cargo runs, some ice planets, to see if we can get some, uh, some more wolframite. So this pipe's starting to empty now. We need to get this fully emptied, and then I'll just nip it off around here or something. Um, and then this other pipe needs to be run somewhere else. In fact, I think I'll put this in down like the bottom of the base or something. This was all meant to be temporary, but it's been here for 1,300 cycles or something. Uh, Rebug mode. Oh, to get some wolframite. No, 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 no. We don't do that. We don't do that. That would be naughty. Yeah, I know, this is pretty dumb. I know this is pretty dumb before anybody tells me this is dumb. I know it's a dumb thing I'm doing. Um, let's just do that instead. I know this is a dumb. Oh, you're referring to the shine bugs for, uh, for debug. I see. Now, we killed them all. Listen, play the cards where they land. We killed them all dead. They are dead now. There are no more shine books. Dead, dead, dead. Dead books. They're dead. Uh, they should have thermoelectric power. That would be cool. 
Afgoski for president. Hmm. Uh, uh, Curiosity's powder, one of those as well. Oh. Since ours was not at equilibrium, it needs another heat source to work. Oh dear, pseudo. Oh, I see. Add them through debug mode so we can call you a cheater. Thanks, Jelly Bear. Thanks. <laughs> How the heck do you keep those things alive anyway? Uh, your best bet, to be honest, I, I don't care about shine bugs, so I didn't put any effort into them. But your best bet is just to collect the eggs and dump their eggs in a separate room somewhere. Um, and then you don't need to feed them, just leave them, and they will reproduce wild. And by the, by the end of the game, you have fucking hundreds of them. Um, I just didn't really care, to be honest. I was not all that concerned. Okay. Crystal one is insane, plus 200 deco. There's only so much deco you need though, Raven. Two hours down the shitter on that. Hey-ho, happens sometimes. Ah, shit. Mate, that's the nature of the beast. That's why debug exists, at least. Or was this in a normal game? Jeez. Um, I'm not sure yet, Foxy. We're sort of, we'll probably take a stand on at the end of the stream tonight. You just want the Abyss one. Feed them Abyss Light. Since you won't need 700 tons of Abyss Light. Yeah, how much have we got? How much Abyss Light we sat at the minute? We have... Uh, where is it? Oh, is it a crafting ingredient now? Where am I looking? Why can't I see it? Is it in miscellaneous or manufactured? Miscellaneous? We have <laughs> 1,072 tons of it. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Yeah, a lot of these sweep commands are gonna have to be cancelled because we're not collecting, we're not collecting like pinch pepper seeds and stuff. I could put the seeds in uh, a storage, in fairness. Uh, I probably will do that actually, just so we can get them swept up and out of the way. Then they look a bit, a bit shitty when they're just all over the place. Oh, we are meant to be collecting them. Why have they not been sweeping the seeds? Then I wonder. Unreachable. Of course it is. Uh, but of course. Fly. Mm -mm. Okay, getting lots of thermium again now, which is good. That's real good. So I'm asking to do a fairly big fucking pipe deep divert here, which is not ideal, but it needs to be done. It needs to be done. It needs to be removed. I'm getting very laggy. What's what's happening? What is the problem? Oh god. Glad I didn't do this legit. That's what I was thinking. Easy and fun deco. Nice hamster. Uh, so many times I accidentally make something of Mafic Rock, I swear it defaults to it. It does, it does Azimuth, it defaults to Mafic Rock. Uh, every time you save and load. It does for me anyway. Yeah, that would make sense. Oh no, I've got more granite than Mafic Rock, and it still defaults to Mafic for me. I don't think that is it, Zoo. I don't think that's true. Somebody said that a couple of streams back, and I was like, I'm not sure if that is the case, but it might be. But I, I have more granite than Mafic Rock, and it always defaults to Mafic on a, on a load. I'm, I'm going to disagree with you, mate. I'm going to disagree. <clears throat> All right, <clears throat> we can nip this off here. Uh, is this pipe nearly emptied? Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So we can now get rid of you and as much of this as we can to like there and to like there. Number 
get rid of all of you and you. Uh, true, it defaults to what you have most of. Well, I've not dug any granite for a very, very, very long time. And I have more granite than I do have mafic rock. And every time I save and load, it defaults to mafic rock. So maybe I've got some granite that's out of reach or something, but then it wouldn't count towards my total, would it? I don't know. Come on. There we go. Oh shit, this will have balls on my suits up, won't it? Fuck, I didn't even think about that. My suit's going to be all over the place now. Uh, shit. How many people have we got down in the oil biome? I bet we've not got eight down here. Piss. Nice. Uh, that is not ideal. I am missing six suits. Son of a bitch. Son of a big old bitch. <sighs> Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> oh, that's why I was lagging so much of a sudden. <laughs> I said before, why am I lagging so much? This is really strange. What's happened here? Give me that suit, you son of a gun. Alright, there's one more somewhere as well. Uh, oh, in fact, no. Oh, shit, I might have done too many. Whatever. That was a mistake. Yeah, we've got two boys down here. That's fine. Oh, no, we've got somebody in here. I wanted him to do this tile first. I didn't realise I'd done all this pipe with priority 9 to be honest. This was meant to be like priority 8. <clears throat> Try and save load, it will default to granite. Um, I really don't want to because it takes me about fucking 10 minutes to do a save and load. But maybe we'll do one before the end of the stream, we'll see. So much CO2, what sorcery is that? What, what do you mean? We've just been collecting it for the entire game. It is dwindling down here, though, because we're not pumping any in at the moment, I don't think. Oh, we are pumping a little bit in. Many CO2s. Many CO2s. Stinky. You sleep here. Stinky, are you a narco? No. Why are you sleep here? Oh, is it buggered up all these? Uh, uh we'll see. We'll we'll do a quick suit check at some point. Life is full of hot air. How dare you? So many materials have finally been implemented since before my break. What do you mean, Alpha? Like what? Oh, he might not have a bed. Maybe the inmates trolled him and stole his bed. Right, okay. Well, that's that done now. We should have the right amount of suits down here now, I think. Have we got a dupe running round? I seem to be missing a suit. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. So that's my last suit down here. And we'll figure the rest out later. Okay. So there's my pipe. Um, This can be connected up. Uh, you're going to need to run through there, which means we need to get rid of this pipe. Like so. We can't reach most of this pipe, but that's fine. Usually I agree that people should enjoy your safe hours, but I don't I can't condone your save that contains a genocide of all the shine, shine books. Uh, it wasn't a genocide. They went on vacation permanently. 
I didn't say it was a genocide hamster. They just, um, they just all stopped breathing around the same sort of time. I don't know why. I honestly don't know why. They just did. And realistically, they shouldn't have died out if you just left them wild. They shouldn't have died out unless they did something stupid. Like killed themselves. I didn't wrangle any of them. I didn't ranch any. They just, they just ceased to be. It's not my fault. I promise. Oops, a daisy. All right. Um. So, I was I was thinking about like what Wachunga said before of doing like a, a shut off valve and having it on each side, having its own atmo uh, atmo sensor automation to toggle on a shut off valve. But I've changed my mind. So we're just going to hook the petroleum generators up. We'll connect this pipe up to there, and then we'll have uh, a bridge, a bridge on each end. Yeah, we'll raise that up a little bit. And uh, yeah, you can just connect like that. Whatever. Oh, it's because of where the port is, isn't it? I wonder why that looks so different. Right, okay. I might need to nip out a couple of tiles to do this, but that's not a big deal. At least then get the petrol chains up and running. So you're gonna to go to there. You're gonna to go to there. I was convinced to be able to reach that. Absolutely convinced I was. Like 200 shine bugs in my base, and it's lagging as bad as jet suits. Fool! I've told you before! Fool, Jax! Fool! That's the problem with shine bugs, they're laggy's balls. <laughs> I, have, I have said this many times. They're not worth it. <sighs> blame the mailman for the death of the shine bugs. Exactly, devil. Now we're getting somewhere. Let's go right to the source of the blame. The fucking mailman. The miserable bastard. Don't blame me, Ezekiel. What the hell? Come on. That's not fair. Right, so these are going to be deactivated as standard until I connect them up, so that's fine. Um, this will also need a crude oil feed up here. Um, and that's probably going to come from here for now. But it will probably have to come from up here eventually, as I mentioned before. We've got this extra pump here that I'll probably change this around a little bit. Hmm. Doing well pumping all this shit out though, which is good. I've got a few more bits to do over here, but obviously these only filters because they've got petroleum around them. But that's fine. We're getting there. Lovely, lovely. Ah. You still have nightmares from the sound the shine bugs made, Rip. <laughs> you know what bugs are worth saving? Shine bugs. No! No, no, no! Told you, they're useless. They're really annoying. You don't need decor. There's only so much decor you need. Tempted to begin another base and go for the whole uh, symmetry is the most important thing, you know what I mean? Um, try it. Go for it. Hey, listen, I'm, I don't try and make everything symmetrical, by the way, guys. I mean, there are some things that you can't get around, like geyser placement and stuff like that. But I do like a bit of symmetry. I like a bit of symmetry with, with, uh, with my game. Just a smidgen. 
Just a smidgen of OCD-based symmetry. It's not a compulsion, I promise. And again, there's certain things you can't avoid, like the actual the actual builds within a room. I don't really stress about being symmetrical. Hellspawn, thank you very much for the follow, buddy. Um, the actual builds within a room, I don't agonise over, but the actual layout of the base, I try and get as symmetrical as I can. But then again, you always get things like, um, like up here, we've got volcano, steam guys. So you know, yeah, you, you can't factor for that. You need to just build around those. <clears throat> There's not much you can do about that shit. I'm going to put a polluted water tank over here, I think, by the way. Because then it'll balance up with the oil tank that we've got. So that's where we'll probably deal with our polluted water from here. Because we are going to need a source of polluted water eventually for um, geysers and stuff. Or at least I'd like to have one in the uh, in the colony for the... Um, you know, if people do want this save file later, then they've got a solution sort of thing. <laughs> You generally revel in the chaos of a base. Yeah, I've done those bases too, mate. I've done those bases too. Listen, building organically is easy. Um, building with a bit of symmetry and a bit of planning it changes the pace of the game a little bit. Not necessarily that it's better. It's just it's easy. It's easy to build organic. It just becomes more of a mess of piping and stuff. That's the only bastard with it. And I don't. I don't dislike organic bases at all. I quite like it normally when you've got like bits of the terrain left in the actual base itself. I think it looks quite cool, but um, it's not something we often go for. But to be honest, I change a little bit like the weather, so who knows? The next base, we might just make a big fucking jungle gym and leave all the natural tiles in place. Who knows? Right, I'm going to need a load of super coolant down here, which I just realised. Um, I can probably make like a little platform here. To fill up the pipe. This needs to be janked around a little bit, but that's okay. <clears throat> uh, what is the steam pressure in your Aquatuna rooms? It varies, Jalabert. Normally I go for about, I don't know, 60 kilos to 100 kilos. It depends. Just whack some water in and see if it needs any more later. I normally just empty, you know, do a few bottle empties and fill it up that way to begin with. Mm -mm. I think we'll start another colony after this one. Uh, I'm not sure, Zoo. Um, unless we decide to do some sort of challenge, I don't know. I'll be honest with you, I quite want to play a few other games that I've got. Um, so, like, I'd quite like to have a blast at the colonists. I'm still waiting for my key to Satisfactory. Um, they're still rolling out alpha keys at the minute. Um, I'd like to play a bit of that if we get the chance. Although, I'd, probably that'll come with an embargo, I don't know. Um, I know some people have already received their keys, but I have not yet. So I would like to play a bit of that as well. Uh, let's get a few suits delivered here. Okay. I don't know if I can be asked to vacuum this room out. It, it would save me effort later. In as much as I'd only have two gases to potentially be worried, worried about. Polluted oxygen and um, carbon dioxide. But I don't know if I want to. It's the terrain what heats and cools a biome. It's the contents normally, Hellspawn, yeah. So whatever's within the uh, the band of Abyssalite, that's sort of what determines what that biome is going to be. So, you know, if we look at this biome here, uh, this is broken because obviously I've got into it, but it would have all been originally like 40 degree material, 45 degree material, like up here. Um, and that, that determines the, the temperature, basically. Once you've dug all that out, it's just an empty space. So once you've dug out all your Abyssalite, there's, there's nothing there to keep it hot or cold. Um, I just thought I built this out of granite. Yeah, this is going to start cooling down quite a bit, but that's okay. All right. So is this pipe now back and working? No, we've got a couple of bits of pipe missing. Just a couple. Uh, when it's less pressure, the airlocks can't keep up pumping the steam. Depends on your on your lock design, Jalabert. If you're using a constant pump design, it doesn't really matter. Um, it also depends on how frequently your steam turbines working. 
yeah, generally the higher the pressure, the more buff you've got. But eventually, it will still the steam turbine will always win uh, if your pump isn't right. Steam turbines move a lot of steam, a lot of steam. Yeah, this is clean as I'm going to do it. Um, let's seal you up and. We've got power in there, haven't we? We've done the power. We've got some basic automation. That should be fine. Let's just seal this up. Obviously, I've, mo I've made this into a pipe here, but I could always just slap a vent in and get it vented first. Do I really care about vacuuming them, guys? What do you reckon? don't think I do. Mm. I've got some other stuff to be doing anyway. That's fine. Um, let's nip you off for a sec. <clears throat> so if I mine all the hot rock out, the biome will cool over time. It, it will cool based on, you know, you'll, you'll have to get rid of that heat. The heat will still linger in the gas that's entering past, you know, the, the hot debris and stuff. But yeah, if you if you cool down the biome, it's cool. It'll stay that temperature forever until it warms up via other means. Um, so yeah, once you've swept everything out, it's, uh, it's fine normally. You just need to cool the gas that's still present and away you go. I want a little bit of water. A little bit of water. And I don't think it'll matter if I put this in first. I don't think it'll matter. Will it matter? How will janky water physics work? Let's put a little bit of polluted water in first. <laughs> uh, is there a reason to connect those pipes on the back side of a bridge instead of just to another pipe? Which pipes are you talking about, TK, uh, TJ? I have constant pump design, but when it's less than 10 kilograms steam per tower, my design fails to move it fast enough for aqua tuners. It's, it's nothing to do with the aqua tuners, Jalabair. It's to do with the steam turbine. Aqua tuners, uh, steam turbines are just beasts. It's that, that simple. They are big boys. They are big boys. I don't know, it should be a way to move more gas at once without having to use door pumps. Mix steam build without airlocks. When you mix hydrogen and oxygen with both gases, it should be around 100 kilos per tile. Um, yeah, that's actually an old exploit uh, people were doing for a while. On steam turbines, they used to struggle to detect what gas was above them, so you could actually bug them out by... Uh, oh, come on. You could actually bug them out by putting a random gas above them. Why are you delivering me tiny little bits of water? What the hell? Where's this water coming from? Give me a big old, big old bottle of it. Must have a bit of water somewhere. Two hundred and forty grams of water. Why is there like little bits of bottled water down there? What the hell? I just want a smattering of water, please. <laughs> Ventilation from the pumps under the generators into the main line. Uh, yeah, it's because I'm dealing with the priority of the line. So bridges, bridges allow you to designate what takes priority on the line. So for example, if you look at this line coming down here, ignore this bridge for a minute, but ignore, if you look at this line coming down here, 
it's going to hit this bridge and only go into this pipe if this pipe is empty. And it's because I want this this uh, pump eventually to take precedent. I want this to be the main line. Uh, and this will be a main line. And then this will only bridge into this if it can. That's the, uh, the idea. Br bridges help you tinker with the priority, basically. They do, they do a lot of stuff, bridges. They're one of the most powerful tools in the game that Clay hasn't uh, nerfed yet. They're, uh, they're pretty good. I'm going to mop all this stuff so our fishies move, because we've got loads of fishies stuck in this little area. And uh, we'll get all this mopped. Get rid of all this shit as well. We've got crap everywhere. We've got fishies up here as well. That'll give us a bit of water as well. Dee, dee, dee. Uh, let's see, rocket's coming back in three cycles and eight cycles. Satisfactory Alpha is under NDA. Yeah, I figured it would be Zoo Hybrid. Normally I make Alphas normally are, unless it's a small game. Stop delivering seven grams of water. Give me more water. Mm. Yeah. Need a big old bottle of water. Can we do some mopping, please? Come on. Oh, this is where the water's coming from. <laughs> um, let's put a couple of people on tidy with a high priority. We must have a few that are already on it. Why, why are they not mopping? Tidy's mopping, isn't it? Mop. Stinky. And shizbut. Do some mopping. There we go. <clears throat> Yeah, I noticed there was a, somebody put another condenser build on the forums the other day, which I thought would be right up your street. I didn't actually pay much attention to it, to be honest, because I know it's a bit of a pain in the ass, so I didn't really look at it. Yeah, we're getting a little bit off gas and off this at the moment, that's fine. Come on! Do I have to put a pitch pump in, really? Have I got any little... Dickish pools of um, water kicking around anyway. Uh, polluted water. Where have I got some polluted water? Excuse me. Um, hmm. Hmm. little bit here. I don't really have access to any, do I? Um, we'll slap a pump down here. Though this is minus 19, that's a little bit cold. We'll slap a pump. Seventy degree, perfect. That'll do, lovely. Incredible. <clears throat> can we even get there? Yeah, just just about, I think. Oh no, maybe we can't. Oh, I need to put my ladder in. Uh, are there any good polluted water builds? I told you that it's a ball lake to fully separate the hot section from the cold section. Uh, polluted water builds, how do you mean, Sudo? My version is better, I haven't updated it, because what's the point? Turbines are all about the heat deletion now with steel aqua tuners, yeah. Yeah, I hear you, bud. Right, we should have plenty of wetter. So let's just knock this down to like a 7 or something. 
I've still, I've still got loads of builds and stuff laid out for them to do at some point. But because I'm always the same, whenever I'm streaming, I do everything like super high priority because I'm conscious that you guys don't want to sit here watching nothing happen for ages. So I'd rather my dupes at least respond quickly. Which is often a little bit detrimental, but it is what it is. Son of a bitch! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Give me a big old bottle of water, come on. I just want one big bottle. Yeah, what did you mean by polluted water, uh, polluted water boiler, pseudo? So we made some monsters with like uh, regolith boilers and stuff. I made one that was a, it was a regolith cooker that made it into magma, that then made natural gas. Obviously, you can't do this anymore. It would make sour gas now, but whatever. It made petroleum, then made natural gas, and then boiled water as the final step. But I think it'd probably need a lot of overhauling now to uh, to get it to work. It would need a lot of tweaks. Many tweaks. Are you trying to vacuum a room with polluted water in it? No, I'm not sorted. I'm just pumping the majority of the oxygen out of there. I'm not, I don't give a shit. It's just a little bit of oxygen in here now. It is going to pick up some polluted oxygen, but it's going to be mostly picking up oxygen. Um, it's because I'm lazy. Eventually I'll run the room at such a high